So I'm here with my wonderful son. Hi. And you're going to be in, you're, this is the first math video that you're in. You're always in my uh, cracking packs of cards. I mean, some of them. Yeah, but this is your first math video. So this video is not about any, well, I'm going to talk about my progress in linear algebra and proofs at the end, but it's really going to be about priorities. So I cut myself in the trap, but I've drawn myself out of broadening to four courses just because I really want to do linear algebra but I, uh, I've been looking at some online courses and I think I'm going to take uh, one on number theory and if that works out then I'll take one on linear algebra next year and the number theory course uses this book right now at least and uses this and the linear algebra uses this book it's a theoretical course and I really want to take them but I think I'm gonna t if I take this one I'll take it later this year and then if I take this one, I'll take it later in late 2023. So it's going to be so long ago. But I caught myself in the trap of, oh, I want to start reading them. Very interesting, you know, uh, you know, vector fields, uh, vector spaces, what's a subspace, all this neat stuff. I don't know. I want to watch videos on it on Saturday mornings, but I'm not going to go crazy on it. Uh, and then also, I caught myself wanting to do... Um, say like when I finish Rosen, a chapter in Rosen, like go through and do a bunch of problems in Strayer, maybe do some problems from Burden. It's kind of funny that they both have seashells. Anyways, I think it's funny. Yeah, I said that the like seashell yeah. on the, what was it, elementary number theory one? Yeah. Uh, it reminded me of um, the Rosen ratio, uh, five. Yeah, exactly, five. Uh, well, the five of the number ratio, because there's a different five, which is the uh, Euler function, which is in number theory. So anyways, I, the title of this video is going to be finish something. I'm not going to do any of that. Fine, every now and then I'll look through this book for recreational purposes. Fine, I'll look through a linear algebra book. Fine, I'll do some, uh, some proofs. But I am going to go and finish as soon as I can uh, both of these books, which are the ones that I've been working on. So I'm already, uh, I have already taken notes uh, all the way to chapter 7 in this book. And this is, by the way, this is the, I just got this book today. It's the Indian edition of the 6th edition, which is the one that I've been using from PDF, which is, you know, killing my, my poor man's printer. So finally I have this book. Uh, this edition uh, looks great. It's very high quality. I love it. And so I'm going to be using it. I just got tired of printing chapters. And I'm, I'm glad that I was able to find this wonderful book. And so... Uh, I think I have finished all the way to chapter 7 for notes uh, and this really is like the core of, a, of a, the basics of number theory uh, I'm gonna I'll, I'll talk more about it in, in the video of number theory I'm gonna stop there but I'm just gonna go I'm gonna do this book cover to cover until like August by which time I think I'll start on that on that number theory book uh, course I mean and then for for uh, calculus I have taken notes and started doing problems on the wonderful chapter 7 which is integration. So I'm actually, I've actually covered, okay, also up to chapter 7 in this book. And so I think I'm going to try to finish Rosen before August and then I'm going to launch on the number theory uh, course online, focus on number theory, maybe do a little calculus on the side. And then early 2023, my plan is to finish all of Thomas and Finney. Look at how far I've gotten. So that's, I think that's a lot of progress. Uh, I'll discuss uh, calculus and number theory in separate videos. But yeah, I have made a little progress and proofs. And I'll make some more progress, but I'm going to go slow because I really got to finish Rosen. I, you know, finish something. So I did do all the problems in chapter one of uh, of uh, Chartrand, Palmani, and Zhang. These were very relaxing problems, very simple, just basic set theory, just really simple stuff by now, thanks to Hammock. So Hammock taught me a lot, and so I was able to just crank out a bunch of problems. I've also been doing some problems from D'Angelo and West. Uh, some are harder, some are easier uh, in chapter one. Uh, so yeah, I'm having fun with those, but again, I'm just, I'm just not gonna, I'm not gonna crank this up. I'm gonna go very slow with proofs too. I already did all of Hammock, so I'm, I'm pretty satisfied with that. 
and then I already printed the logic chapter from Chartrand uh, and at some point I'm gonna work on that but I'll, I'll be giving very few updates on proofs in linear algebra I think uh, just because it's all Rosen from now on then for, li for linear algebra sure I started taking notes on the uh, bigger linear algebra book that I have uh, and then I also have notes which are not here on the, uh, the theory book but it's gonna go very slow it's gonna be Rosen, Rosen, Rosen so I'm done with this video all about priorities finish something I have to finish this guy I have to finish this book cover to cover uh, throughout April, May, June, July, August. So I have four and a half months, four months roughly, because I think I want to start taking that course in, in, the big, in the middle of August. And I think I have enough time. I already have all the notes up to chapter seven. So, of course, and then I'll show the, the actual work itself in the video for number theory. But yeah, finish something, and that something is this guy right here.